Hi there everybody, this is Natasha Wilkinson, your Independent Sensory Consultant from Bathurst, New South Wales. You're currently looking at the view. Isn't it a gorgeous view from my front veranda? Now, we're about to delve into some Bring Back My Bar Voting, my bar voting Together. And we're going to vote for some returning scents. We're going to vote in specifically for the top 12 returning scents that will return in June or July. I think it's July that they return. So we cast votes now over the next few days and the top 12 picked out of all consultants, all customers, anyone that goes onto a Scentsy website and chooses their favorite returning scents, they will be calculated and they will be brought back for the month of July where you can purchase them and add them to club and all sorts of things. So let's delve into some Bring Back My Bar voting, shall we? So here we are on my website. To get to Bring Back My Bar voting, go to your consultant's website or a consultant's website in anywhere in Australia. It doesn't matter. And you'll see here that it says, vote for the Sensi Bars you'd like to see again. So we're going into that section of the website and as you see we can vote five times you can vote for the same scent five times you can vote for five different scents and it gives you the options of scents you can vote down here now there was a rule that they brought out with bring back my bar the last two rounds supposedly the last winners of the last five years weren't to be included in the round of voting but i don't know if maybe we didn't have enough sense here in our region for them to do that because that seems to be have thrown out the window here because i have only been a consultant for three years and there have been i counted 29 cents in this round that we can vote for that have been previous bring back my bars on which I have given reviews on and which I have purchased, some of which I've added to club, some of which I have regretted not adding to club. So there are at least 29 cents here that I would have thought would have been not eligible for this round of Bring Back My Voting, voting but they are in this round of voting. So if you love those cents, by all means, go ahead and vote for them because just because I have them in my club doesn't mean everyone's experienced them and they may have been sensed that other people have missed out on. So let's get into it, shall we? I'm not gonna go through every scent note here. If you wanna know more of the scent notes and don't know what a scent might smell like, for example, Adored, if we hit few details, it will come up with fun, flirtatious cherry, black pum, and a warm whiff of sandalwood, spin off a succulent springtime yarn. So that's gonna give you more information on scents. What I will do, ones I, know of or that have been in previous bring back my bars i will let you know what the scent smells like and i'll also let you know if they've been in previous bring back my bars just so you can get an idea of what has been in a bring back my bar and what hasn't or what has been in the collection as my time as a consultant in the last three years so i've never experienced a dawd hello a citrus was I believe in our catalogue at one stage while I was a consultant. I remember it being a little bit tropical on the tropical side. Those type of scents I myself personally don't gravitate to, but I know they are really popular. Amethyst was part of the crystal collection. I've never experienced that myself and I've never experienced apple and cinnamon sticks. But if you like spice scents, I hear that's a really good one. Apple butter frosting. So this was a bring back my bar about two and a half years ago. It did make it back into the voting and I wish I had more in my club. The reason I didn't have more in my club of apple butter frosting is because when I got my first batch with my consultant kit, I got a old bar that had gone off and it didn't smell like it was meant to, but I had heard enough reviews to know that that particular scent wasn't what it was meant to smell like. So I kept it in my club 
and I'm lucky I didn't take it out of my club because when I started getting fresh pearls, this is a beautiful buttery apple cinnamon scent. It is absolutely one of my favourites. It's one if I had gotten a fresh pour from the beginning in my consultant's kit, I probably would have had more in my club. So I'm going to cast one vote to that because if that comes back, that's going to be increased in my club. Apple Crush. I have a feeling that was the first spring but my bar I experienced. It's a green apple scent. Arctic Kiss was a scent of the month in December of 2020. It's a beautiful, beautiful scent. And it's one that I'm voting for because I, again, I wish I had more in my club. While it's in my club, I don't have enough. It's sweet, it's fresh, it's clean, it's slightly cool. It is absolutely gorgeous. Atlas Cedar I have never tried. I've never tried Autumn Sunset. Baked apple pie is apple and spices. I don't get a pie crust to it. It was a bring back my bar a few years ago. Bamboo Yuzu was a bring back of my bar. Or was it part of another collection? I can't remember, but again... I don't think it was one of those scents I gravitated towards, so I can't remember much about it, but I do remember it being around. Banana Berry was part of the Easter collection a few years ago. On cold to me, Banana Berry smells like lolly bananas and the strawberries and cream lollies. But when Banana Berry is warming, it smells like a beautiful banana pudding. I will say it is not strong and it is not long lasting, but it is a very beautiful scent. Be Merry was part of one of our Christmas collections. Beach, I know I didn't like, and I know it was a bring back my bar. It was the bring back my bar I first experienced in 2020, along with Beach Daisy, which is a beautiful, sweet, bright floral scent we recently just had beach daisy available in bricks in our summer collection bergamot bay i've never tried berry cosmo boogie now this was part of the dance collection and i believe i've tried this once in a flash sale sugared grapefruit maybe not maybe this is the one i didn't try it was strawberry daiquiri i tried so this is part of the dance collection and i believe this is the only one out of the dance collection i actually haven't tried reading the scent notes berry of paradise that was a bring back my bar a few years ago if you like scents like our current strawberry swirl which is a current bring back my bar angel experiment 626 it's along those similar lines. Blackberry meringue and blackberry orange marmalade were a bring back my bar a few years ago. I don't remember much about them. Blue raspberry ice was also a bring back my bar a few years ago. Now this one was interesting to me. I was expecting it to be more sweeter, but it definitely had that white lemon that shone through for me where it says stack of sweet cherry icy. So it was very cooling. It was almost a sorbet sweet ice block type scent. Botanical Garden, I've never tried. I've never tried Brazilian grapes. I've never tried cactus flower and lime. I've never tried Ambridge. I've never tried candied pomegranate. Caramel Pear Crisp was a bring back my bar a few years ago. And that was a nice twist on a pear scent. A lot of pear scents I've tried are either perfumey or just plain up fruity and I'm very picky with pear scents. When they start to add desserts to pear scents it gives it a really nice twist. Caramel sugar cone that is currently in my club. It smells like to me the caramel that you dip your toffee apples in. So the boiling toffee in a pot so more of a glaze as opposed to a chewy caramel cashmere pear i've never tried chamomile daisy was from our life's a garden collection i remember not being the biggest fan of that it was a little bit too tea for me cherry vanilla i have never tried chocolate coconut cream was a bring back my bar a few years ago as a scentsy club exclusive and that is just beautiful. It is in my club. 
if you like chocolate scents, you will love chocolate coconut cream. It is just this creamy, rich, warm chocolate scent. Christmas cactus I've never tried. Citrine was part of a crystal collection, which I have never tried. The crystal collection was before my time. Citrus Isle, Clean Breeze was in our catalogue. It's a clean laundry scent. Clementine Clambury, I've never tried. Clove and Cinnamon, I've never tried. Coconut Coast, I've never tried. So, Coconut Daiquiri was from a summer collection a few years back. It's banana, it's coconut, it's supposed to have a daiquiri note. And it's the daiquiri note that I wasn't a fan of in there. It's a little bit summery, a little bit sunscreeny. Coconut oil and linen, if you love those sunscreeny scents, that's another one you will like. It's laundry mixed with like a sunscreen. Cotton candy cookie was from a Easter collection a few years back. It is what it is. Cotton candy and cookie mixed together. You would think those two scents wouldn't work, but they do. Cozy Fireside, I've heard a lot about, but I've never tried. Same with Cranberry and Tinsel. Crisp Orchid Air, I've never tried. Crumb Top was a bring back my bar a few years ago. It is in my club. It will never leave my club. It reminds me of my grandfather cooking porridge. And that's what it is. It's a oat type scent. It's great for a mixer, but it's beautiful on its own. Cucumber hibiscus I've never tried. Cup of comfort I've never tried. But if you like coffee scents, it's meant to be a coffee scent. Dark Harbour I've never tried. Darling Dahlia I've never tried. Davenport I've never tried. Dulce de Leche I remember being a bring back my bar. It's supposed to be a bakery scent, but I don't remember much about it really. I do remember it was one of the first bring back my bars I did experience. Emerald Waters, I've never tried. Enchanted Mist, I've never tried. Feeling Freesia, I've never tried. Fiji and Kiwi, I've never tried. Fiji Flower was part of that same summer collection that Coconut Daiquiri was from. It's a beautiful, sweet, tropical flower. I am going to throw a vote to Fiji Flower. I didn't keep it in my club when it first came out because it is on the softer side, but I never gave it a chance to cure. And I find in scents like that, after I give them a chance to cure, sometimes work a lot better. I'm also finding in this new house, scents are throwing a lot better too. So I'm getting better performance with scents in this new house here. Forest Wildflower, I've never tried. Forever Yours, I've never tried. Fresh Cut Daisies, I've never tried. Frosted White Birch, I've never tried. Gingerbread Donut was a bring back my bar a few years back and it was a spicy gingerbread scent to me. I got a lot of that gingerbread. I wasn't the biggest fan of that one. I do know a lot of people do love that one though. Give Me Passion Flower, I've never tried. Gleeful Grape, I've never tried. Go Wildflowers, I've never tried. I vaguely remember Goody Goody Gundrop being a bring back my bar in my time too, but I just can't remember what it smelled like. Green Cowsa, I've never tried. Green Palm Blossom, I've never tried. Happy Birthday, this has been a bring back my bar a couple of times since I think I've been a consultant. And it is a vanilla chocolate marble cake to me you get a lot more of the vanilla cake but sometimes a little bit of that chocolate just shines through happy go lucky i've never tried havana cabana i've never tried heartbreaker i've never tried highway run i've never tried ice pine i've never tried jet set go i've never tried jungle jam i've never tried juniper berry i've never tried just keep swimming, although it was in the catalogue when I first joined, I actually have never tried. Lapis Lazuli, I've never tried. Lafa Palooza, I've never tried. Lavender Violet, I'm voting for this one. I did have it in my club. It was probably the only one out of the Life's a Garden collection that I did like. It's a beautiful lavender scent with a marshmallow base. Lemon Daisy, I've never tried. Lemon Sugar and Sheer, I've never tried. Lemon Verbena, I've never tried. Lemongrass and Ginger, I've never tried. 
Let's Get Punchy, I believe it was part of that same summer collection. I don't think I liked it from memory. Life in Bloom, I've never tried. Life is Swell, I've never tried. Lilacs and Violets, I've never tried. Lime, Kiwi and Cantaloupe, I've never tried. Lime and Sugar Cane, I've never tried. Love Story, this is in my club. Now, the scent notes for Love Story say Amber, Chocolate and Roses. You don't get the chocolate, you don't get the roses. You get a very heady, sweet amber. I think the chocolate adds a richness and I think the roses just adds a softness and a powderiness to it. But if you're looking for a beautiful, romantic scent, Love Story is the scent to go for. Lovely lychee, I've never tried. Lucky star fruit, I've never tried. Luminous lagoon, I've never tried. Now, I'm down to one vote, so we're going to have to come back to those scents. But, Lush Gardenia. This is the scent I regret taking out of my club. It smells exactly like a gardenia. It gives me scent memories of my grandmother's house. It is a strong performer. That is one I would love to see back so I can put it in my club. Mandarin and Mango Nectar was from that summer collection. I remember not really liking it I, for some reason. Mandarin Grapefruit Amber, I've never tried. Mandarin Moon, I've never tried. Mellow Moment, I've never tried. Melon and Apple Granita, I've never tried. Mountain Sky, I've never tried. Mulan True to Your Heart, it was nice, but it wasn't too memorable. Mustics was a Bring Back My Bar. To me, it was very old ladylike perfume. Mystic Magnolia, I've never tried. Nashi Nectar, I've never tried. Now and Zen, I've never tried. Ocean, I'm really enjoying that in the whiffs, but I've never actually tried it in the... I've never actually tried it in the wax before. Ode to Opulence. But if you're after something fresh, laundry, aquatic, Ocean would be a good vote. Ode to Opulence, I've never tried. Orange Flower, I've never tried. Orangey Glad, I've never tried. Pacific Daydream, I've never tried. Passion Fruit and Vanilla, I've never tried. Pear Blossom, I've never tried. Peppermint Dreams is in my club. It smells like a chocolate peppermint cream absolutely beautiful i'm hoping these notifications aren't showing up on the screen as i'm doing this from all my emails that keep popping up here perfect oatmeal so that was also a bring back my bar a few years ago it has a cranberry note in it which to me makes it smell more like a toasted muesli bar than just an oatmeal perfect peppermint was from the christmas collection if you're after a strong peppermint scent Perfect Peppermint would be the one to choose. Perfectly Pomegranate, I don't really like. It's too fake pomegranate to my nose. Perk Me Up is a good coffee scent. That was also a bring back my bar a few years ago. Persian and Lime and Sandwood, I've never tried. Pina Colada Cha Cha, part of the dance collection. Smells exactly like the drink. Pineapple Lolly was sickly sweet to me it was also a bring back my bar a few years ago it was like a fake lolly scent i did not like it pineapple mint i didn't mind this from the life's a garden collection but i wasn't blown away but if you're like pin for like a fresher pineapple scent that would probably be one to look at voting for pineapple sorbet i've never tried pink currant and birch would i've never tried Pink pomenade, I've never tried. Pistachio ice cream, I've never tried, but I have heard good things about. Polynesian dreams, I've never tried. Pomegranate pear, I've never tried. Poppy and blush suede, I've never tried. Posy peach, I've never tried. Pretty and plum, this is another regret of mine. It was a bring back my bar a few years ago. It is absolutely beautiful. I wish I had that in my club. It's a little bit more... I guess you could say perfumier than sweet plum pastry because of the coconut essence to it. But it is really, really pretty. Prick, but it is still bakery. Prickly pear and agave, I've never tried. It was in our catalogue when I joined. Pristine waters, I've never tried. 
pumpkin, marshmallow, I've never tried. Quiet Grove, I've never tried. Rainforest Bungalow, I've never tried. Raspberry Bush, I've never tried. Red Berry and Spruce. If you're after a sweet Christmas tree with that berries mixed, that's the perfect scent. It's not a heavy Christmas tree, and that's what I really loved about it when it was part of our sense of the season a few years back. Rock and Ruby Raz. This was one my daughter really liked. It's not for me. It's very fruity. It's very candy-like. But it is one that we've seen a few times in both Bring Back My Bar and in Thinking an Easter collection. Rose Quartz, part of the Crystal collection. Rosemary Mint, I've never tried. Sakura Blossom, I've never tried. Salted Lavender, I've never tried. Sea Sun and Farn, I've never tried. Sedona Sunset, I've never tried. She Leather's a leather smell. She Woods, I've never tried. Simply Cinnamon, I've never tried. Simply Irresistible, I've never tried. Simply Lemon, I've never tried. Simply Lime, I've never tried. Simply Nashi Pear, I've never tried. Simply Patchouli, I've never tried. Simply Rose, it is Rose. Full on Rose, really strong. You gotta love Rose to love Rose. Simply Spice, I've never tried. Simply Strawberry, that's a really nice mixer with Happy Birthday. Simply Vanilla, it's more of a perfumey vanilla. Skinny dipping, I've never tried. Snow Lil, I wasn't the biggest fan of. It was in a recent Bring Back My Bar, quite a recent Bring Back My Bar. I think about two, maybe three Bring Back My Bars, if I remember rightly. Spiced berries, I've never tried. Spiced pear, I've never tried. Squeeze the date. If you want a lemon scent that smells like authentic lemons with just a little bit of sweetness, Squeeze the Day is perfect. It's perfect for cleaning the house. It was in our catalogue a while back. It discontinued about two years ago. Starfruit and pear nectar, I have never tried. Stay a while, I've never tried. Sticky cinnamon bun was a bring back my bar a few rounds ago. It's more cinnamon to me than sticky bun. I do have it in my club along with frosted cinnamon roll. And I was deciding whether do I keep both of them. I do want to get another sticky cinnamon bun to see whether I keep both of them. But I feel like I like frosted cinnamon roll just a little bit more. Strawberry taffy, I've never tried. Sugar and spice, I've never tried. Sugar cherry, I've never tried. Summer rain, it's quite a clean scent. Doesn't smell like rain though to me. Sunburst blooms, I've never tried. Sunflower and sandalwood, I've never tried. Sunflower patch, I've never tried. Sunny and share, I've never tried. Sweet berry and sweet cucumber, I've never tried. Sweet plum pastry. This to me smells like plums boiling in a pot just before you make your pies. I don't get a pastry night, but I do enjoy it. Tea loaf, and that's in my club also. Tea loaf and rose, I've never tried. Thunderstorm has like a very fresh but floral aspect about it you can smell like rose in it as well Thierry and Mayu I've never tried toaster nut coconut and amaretto I've never tried toffee butter crunch is a rich toffee scent it is in my club it has been a bring back my bar within the last five years tropic tango I've never tried vanilla oud this is a beautiful deep rich woodsy scent has been a bring back my bar in the last few years but if you missed out on trying this one, it's definitely one worth voting back. Very Merry Cranberry, I've never tried. But it had been in our catalogue for a while before it had discontinued. If you like cranberry scents at Christmas time, you'd probably like that. And I'd be more inclined to try that now than I was when I first joined. And some of these scents that discontinued when I first joined, I kind of wish I'd tried before they discontinued. Vibin, I've never tried. Watermelon Mint. So uh, this is a really nice mint watermelon scent. More watermelon, fresh watermelon probably than mint, but it is beautiful for summer. I've never tried watermelon wave. Welcome home. This is a beautiful, almost pop puree, warm scent. It is spices, but it's not aggressive spices. Whipped vanilla pear was another really good combo of bakery and pear which was a bring back my bar a few years ago white grapefruit i've never tried white out mint apple and trees it is absolutely beautiful wild red berry 
sweet melon I've tried, wild watermelon I've never tried, winter pine I've never tried, world traveller. So that's a cologne scent from memory. You, me in the sea I've never tried, you're my buttercup, you're the zest and yuzu dragon. I don't remember much about yuzu dragon. I remember it being around and might have tried it once, but I just can't remember much about it. So they are the scents that are available. I've still got one more, so I'm just going to do whipped vanilla pear for that one. So I've got apple butter frosting, Arctic kiss, Fiji flower, lavender violet, whipped vanilla pear. Now I'm required to submit a email address. So I'm just going to submit my email address. And it just wants to authenticate me by selecting all the cars. So, thank you. Your votes have been tallied. So, that will go towards the current tally of votes. So, that is how you vote for Bring Back My Bar. What other scents you're going to vote for? I hope you enjoy this video. Until next time, stay safe and bye for now.